warm up with an old uh, by Green Day. Green Day. Good riddance. Another turning point to folks stuck in the mood. Time grabs you by the wrist, directs you where to go. So make the best this test and don't ask why. Not a lesson, it's a question learned in time. It's something unpredictable in the end is right. Hope you're having the time of your life. So take the photographs and still frames from your mind. Put them on the shelf in good health and good time. Tattoos of memories and dead skin I'm trying. For what it's worth, worth all the while. Something unpredictable and in the end is right. Hold your hand in the time of your life. Tim Hawkins did a parody of that. I love parodies. It's called Things You Don't Say to Your Wife. Honey, have you gained some weight in your rear end? You know, that dress you're wearing reminds me of my old girlfriend. Where did you get those shoes? I think they're pretty lame. Please stop talking because I'm trying to watch the game. Now if you are the kind of man wants to live a long and happy life, these are things that you don't say to your wife. Um, I planned a hunting trip next week on your birthday. I didn't ask you because I knew it'd be okay. Now go make supper while I watch this fishing show. I'm taping over our old wedding video. Now if you are the kind of man who wants to live a long and happy life, these are things that you never say to your wife. Well, your cooking's pretty good, but not like mother makes. That diamond in the ring I bought you, it's a fake. Let's see. Uh, your eyes, your eyes look puffy, dear. Are you feeling ill? Happy anniversary, I bought you a treadmill. Now if you are the kind of man wants to not get stabbed with a great big knife, these are things that you never say to your wife. Okay, Tim Hawkins. Now I, I love, I love parodies. I love parodies like that. I wrote a new one. I wrote a new one. It's not done yet. I played it for my wife, Carol, and she took me by both shoulders, looked me in the eyes, and said, never play that song anywhere. So I know it's a pretty good song. I can't do it. I'm not doing, I'm not doing it tonight. Next, next time we're all here, I'll do it. It's called My Gay BCs. I, I'm not going to do it tonight. I am going to do... Uh, I am going to do the teaser song. My wife says no about everything this one is by the Emer Everly Brothers, uh, called Dream, Dream, Dream. Dream, 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 Dream. Whenever I want you in my arms, and whenever I need you, and your charms, whenever I want you, all I have to do is is dream, 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 dream. I just think it's fine, I can make you mine, anytime, night or day. Only trouble is, gee whiz, I'm dreaming my whole life away. Okay, that's a nice little song. A lot of harmonies, but you know, I heard the other day there's a whole generation of men who spend 2,000 hours a year. 2,000 hours a year. That's a full-time job. Looking at their computer screen, loving their computer screen. I love my screen. 
My computer screen, I'm in love with my screen. My computer screen, you know, I don't date. I never leave the house. I put one hand down my pants, the other one's on the mouse. Oh, I love my computer screen. I just think it's fine. I can always find uh, sexy girls on display. Only trouble is, gee whiz, I've been stroking it for three or four days. I found Pornhub, and I found Red Tube, and I've got a box of Kleenex, and a great big jar of Lubo. I love my computer screen. I just think it's fine. I can always find something to turn me on. Only trouble is, gee whiz, my left arm is getting really strong. I love my screen. Please pass my Vaseline. Oh, I love my computer screen. I just think it's fine. I can always find sexy girls beyond compare. Only trouble is, gee whiz, my palms are starting to grow hair. I love my screen. I can always find sexy stuff online until I finally go blind. Okay. A couple of these have been requested. Um, uh, let's see, I'm going to do geezer next. Yeah, this is uh, this is another parody. This was, uh, let's see, Dion and the Belmonts, 1959, and Why Must I Be a Teenager in Love. Each time we have a quarrel, it almost breaks my heart. I am so afraid that we'll have to part. Each night I pray to the stars up above. Why must I be a teenager in love? Well, anyway, that's Dion and the Belmonts, but I had to change it. I've been a teenager in love in like half a century, so I changed it to uh, Why Must I Be an Old Geezer in Love? And it goes like this. I met you in the old folks' home, but my mind is a blur. I know we got it on, but I can't remember who you were. Each night I pray to the stars up above. Why must I be an old geezer in love? Listen. I took off my underwear, but to your surprise, there was nothing under there that you could even recognize. Each night I pray to the stars up above. Why must I be an old geezer in love? Now in a couple years, we're both gonna die so let's get naked hell let's give it one more try you offered oral sex so i whipped it out i just have one request please take your false teeth out each night i pray to the stars up above why must i be an old geezer in love let's see you took off your bra your tits hit the floor. I tried to grab my pecker, but I can't find it anymore. Let's see. Oh, you are such a flirt. You hitched up your skirt. I took off my pants, leaking my incontinence. So each night I pray to the stars up above that you'll keep doing all that sexy stuff I love. Okay, that's one more. One more. This is uh, Bobby Hinton, 1961. Blue Velvet. No, not Blue Velvet. No. Wait a minute. Roses are red, my love. Take good care of my baby. Oh, that's Bobby V. Bobby V. 
Bobby Vent, that's me. Bobby Vent. That's me. My tears are falling because you've taken her away. And even though it hurts me so, there's something I gotta say. Take good care of my baby. Don't you ever make her blue. Just tell her that you love her, that you're thinking of her, and everything you say and do. Take good care of my baby. Don't you ever make her cry. Just let your love surround her, paint rainbows all around her. Don't let her see a cloudy sky. Well, once upon a time, that little girl was mine. If I had been true, I know she wouldn't be with you. So take good care of my baby. You be as kind as you can be. And if you should discover that you don't really love her, just send my baby back home. Well, you know, that's okay for 1961, but you can't have your lover go out there chasing around with every Tom and Harry dick in the neighborhood and come home. There's diseases out there, so I had to add a verse. Now those guys gave something to my baby. My baby brought it home to me. And as I soon discovered, she contracted from her lovers some really weird and itchy, yes. <laughs> 